Hey guys. Welcome to this edition of Central Coast Bass. I'm back here at Pino. I'm not in a boat. I'm just gonna go fish from shore. And hopefully, I can catch myself some bass. Hope you enjoy it. All right, guys. I've been uh, I've been talking to one of my viewers for a while. My friend Rick showed up, and uh, I don't know where he is. Thought he was gonna fish, but uh, I don't know. He saw me. Talked to me for a sec. But I was talking to somebody else. If it was more green, this color would stand out more. This might be more baby bass. Color, something more sparkly. No, I mean, see the color? It's kind of brownish. I mean, I have yellow lenses on, so due to the lenses, it looks green, but without my glasses on, it looks brown. That's not good. Yeah, that's fish. Is that fish? Yeah, that's fish. Oh, there you go. Yeah, they do like this color. Purple color, no? Yeah, it's more of a yeah, it's purple brown. He came off? Yeah, he came off. Well, that ain't gonna help me catch a fish. Thought it felt heavy the whole way in. <laughs> oh, really? Wow. That'll catch him. Wow. All right, let's see if any are out there on that rock. Doesn't seem to be much this way. Seems like I should be getting a lot more bites. Should be something hitting it. I'm gonna switch to lighter color. I'm gonna actually switch to cut tail. Baby bass color, four inch, different look. Try a different look. This stands out too much in this water. Too bright. A little more subtle. Try the uh, watermelon candy. Watermelon candy. Color that's been working at other lakes. Something that's more subtle, guys. Stands out pretty good, but it's much more subtle. Get him. Get him. I got that. Really? Catching your own bait? Look at that, guys. He's recovering his bait from yesterday. That works. Lose it one day, recover it the next. Not much going on, guys. Got one little fish right away. Let's see what I can catch in a couple hours. This used to be an island. Now it's totally attached. <laughs> It's like part of shore now, and part of the ramp. There you go. Way to whack them. Catch them like crazy over here. Just that one. Another one? You're the bluegill master. It's getting really shallow in here now, guys. Bunch of grass. And it's not that clean. Comes that big ugly bird. He really knows how to land well. Alright, let me try the purple on the net. I think I have one hooked up that's heavier. Nope, not even a bite. Let me come over here with the dark on the net. It's the only place I got in a bite. Used to be able to catch tons of little ones all the time. Don't even want the Ned rig. Try a different color on the drop shot. And let me go explore over the beach. Just for fun. Often a good spot right here. Hmm, it's exciting guys. Alright, I'm going back to color, the only color that's gotten a bite, which is the dark. Purple and brown got a bite. 
It's the only color so far that's gotten a bite. And it was sort of my first choice. Not many bass around at all. Horrible. Horrible. Fish are just not biting. I heard a geese heading this way again. Looks like they go from over there to over here. Oh, let's try over here. The dead zone, guys. Pinto's a dead zone. It is an absolute dead zone, guys. Once they start hitting in the next like 20 minutes, I'm done with this show. Pinto, the dead zone. There's just nothing, 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 guys. And that's the only place I got a bite, it's right here. It's the only place I got a bite. Damn it. Oh, broke me off, I think. Yep. Oh, I re-rigged the drop shot now. Oh my god, guys. Yes! I got a bite! I got a nibble! Didn't feel very big, but something actually hit my worm. Yay! I think I'm done with this show, guys. One little fish that got off, one little bite. That is it. That is it. Look at that, guys. There are fish in here. Was that a little, the little square bill? Yeah. Oh, you just swiped at it, huh? There's like another one with it or something. Another one following him? Yeah, look at that. He just swiped it. It's in his head, huh? He swiped it? He didn't even eat it. He just swiped at it. Look, there's three with him. Look, there's three? Oh, yeah, there is. Look at that, guys. One, and then there's the other one over there. Look at that. Look, four. There's four of them. See? There's always fish around, even if you're not catching them, they're there. He catches that one fish and there's four others following it. They must have been uh, competing for it or something. There goes the other one right there, one of them. That's weird, <laughs> he catches one fish and four others want to eat what he had in his mouth. Look at how he, look at how he hit it. Look at that, guys. Just, just one, one right in the freaking snout. So they must have been competing over it. And he's the one that grabbed it. He's the one that got it, so that's cool. Good ending, at least somebody caught good a ending. fish. Someone got <laughs> I caught one little one that got off. Yeah, that's a good that's a good three. Whoops. Oh no. Oh I didn't mean I didn't mean for you to give them to me. Thank you guys, they just barely in the lip. Barely hooked with one of the fucking. But there were four fish following him in means they're all competing and trying to get that crank out of his mouth. Yeah, I didn't get anything. He caught that. There were four fish trying, following it, trying to get the freaking crank out of his mouth. Yeah. I can't get a freaking bite. He hooks one and there's four fish competing. Definitely a lot of fish here. They just got it on the crank. There were four fish following it in. The others were, that one was looked bigger than that one. You know, that one that was right in it, that came up right under it looked bigger. Yeah, it did look bigger. It looked a little bit bigger. It was like they were spawning. It was like sitting there right yeah, up right sit, up next yeah, to it. Right that. Next to it. it was like he was looking to just take it out of his mouth. He saw the crank on the side of his face. Yeah, he, he seen wanted it. He just wanted that'd have been cool it. if he would have grabbed it. You could have got two. <laughs> They're here, guys. All right, guys, that's going to do it for this edition of Seneca's Bass. It was a little quick one. I was only here for about two and a half hours. See, I caught that one little fish. Didn't get any bites on that slow stuff. He throws a crank. <laughs> Catches that nice fish, and it had four followers trying to take the freaking crank out of his mouth. I don't know, maybe it's an evening thing. But that was really weird. I mean, <laughs> I didn't try anything active. I mean, what? I'm trying to end my show. Would you be quiet, please? Yeah, it wasn't the best show. I mean, as far as me, I just had that one little one, but that was kind of cool and educational right there. I mean, 
So they're here, they just want a reaction type bite. They're not they're not eating any of the slow stuff, so I don't know. Anyway, it was short and quick. I still hope you guys enjoyed it. And please join us for our next Sunday Coast Bass Fishing Show. Give us some likes, share, and as always, sub if you have.